York's second in command says he will not run alongside Governor Cuomo later this year. We're digging into what's behind his decision. News 4's Nalina Shapiro joins us with more. Nalina. Well, Teresa, the, the lieutenant governor says this will be the end of his public service career. He says this was purely a life decision. He's from Rochester and he says he wants to spend the rest of his life in the Finger Lakes region. Governor Andrew Cuomo just released a statement saying in part that my administration and all of New York State owes him a tremendous debt of gratitude. Duffy says he's planning to campaign for the governor's reelection this year and hopes to contribute to the administration in different forms in the future. Duffy previously served as the mayor of Rochester. Before that, he was Rochester's chief of police. Erie County Democratic Committee Chair Jeremy Zellner hopes someone from Western New York runs alongside the governor in the fall. Certainly our mayor would be a strong candidate for lieutenant governor. He's done a tremendous job with our city. He's been an incredible steward for the city. We're seeing development like uh, historic development going on. I think our county executive would be a tremendous candidate. He's um, doing some great things with CPS reform statewide right now as well. And Kathy Hochul certainly would be a strong candidate for lieutenant governor as well. Zellner says state officials will decide who to support at a committee meeting in about 10 days. An announcement will then be made at that meeting, so this process could happen pretty quickly. Reporting live, Nalina Shapiro, News 4 at noon.